hey guys welcome back to another vlog we are on the back patio today i felt like it was time to do something new for summer and our jacuzzi came just in time originally i was gonna put it outside there but after seeing an alligator in our backyard i was like okay it has to go in the back patio so this is what the patio looked like before and we just slid everything over to the left to create this space for the jacuzzi and it was a perfect fit I wasn't sure what to expect for the insulation, but it was an easy process. We just took everything out and connected a few parts. Luckily, I had an air pump in my garage that I completely forgot about to blow this up. This fits up to four to six people. There's also a built-in filtration system to keep the water clean. We will be using ours on the cool, cold setting while it's summer here in Florida, but this will be equally as nice during the winter. It also comes with this rug that goes right outside the hot tub for when you step out. Now it was time to start filling it up and after this it couldn't be moved. I tried to move it just an inch to get the cover on after. Didn't think it's full with water but there are the jets on. We love this. The kids could not wait to get in. They're going to be using this all summer. And this is what I did with the rest of the patio, added some throw blankets and throw pillows. This is the cover on, it was just enough space for me to fit it on. I love that it comes with a cover so it can stay clean. That's where we ended up putting our egg chair with some throw pillows and this is what our new patio looks like. We are loving it so far. Thank you so much Relax Time for sending this to us. I'm going to have all the links in the description. Oh, little Misa Mo, she loves playing with my robe belts. All of them are all scratched up and bit up now, but this is her favorite thing to do with Sultan and only Sultan. So I thought I would include some cute little clips of her just being adorable. Now this is a little bit of the behind the scenes that I did to the at home Chipotle reel that I posted on Instagram. It's also here in a short on YouTube, I think. Uh, these were so good. I did chicken and then beef because Ruby didn't like chicken. Um, but we're also making it again. I'm making it right now as we speak. And also during this time, Ruby wanted to dye her hair. So that's what she's doing. I didn't want any parts. I've never dyed my hair before. This is going to be her second time. Her aunt did it the first time, but she was determined to do it on her own this time. So I'm just here for moral support and to watch and supervise, I guess. Her roots have grown out a lot. She's dyeing it the exact same color, just with some blonde highlights this time. Oh, we decided to try to make tanhulu. That's all of our strawberries washed, dried, and we just cut off the tops, getting ready to put them on the skewers and make our ice bath. I also made some pot stickers with some homemade sauce and lots of green onions. We love green onions. And then we were ready to melt down our sugar and start our tanhulu. It came out okay. It was really sticky. Um, I think we left it in the water too long, but it was only our first go. So, oh, and we also got crumble cookie. This was this week's lineup. We didn't get butter cake until a few days later, but it wasn't my fave. My favorite one was the lemon one. This is my first time making katsu chicken, so I wasn't sure if I would need seasonings. I just went ahead and grabbed my all-purpose seasoning just in case. Now I went ahead and split my chicken breast in half and wrap them in some saran wrap and just gently pounding on them to flatten them to a quarter inch thick. I didn't realize that the recipe said I would have to salt them generously and leave in the fridge for an hour, so that's why I was considering using the seasoning, but I just winged it and it turned out really good. Don't you know? Well, you should know that. 
I already had some going. I had to do these in two batches. Um, I'm patting in some salt and then doing the flour, egg, and then breadcrumb. Also have the oven set to 200. You're supposed to fry for one to two minutes on each side and then put in the oven to finish cooking. Drowning And this is how the katsu chicken turned out. It was so good. Definitely something I will be making again. And lately the kids have been obsessed with making candy salads. And I can't lie, I like the candy salad too. Um, we have a reel on Instagram if you want to see what we put in here. But this was basically our dessert. It's so dark because it's pouring rain outside now. Do you hear like a creaking sound? 
that's the chair. I'm in my dad's office. I'm at my mom's house. I'm about to do some press-on nails. I've tried these. I didn't try these exact ones, but I've tried press-ons before and they didn't work out. But Ruby uses them all the time and hers always look really good. So I'm trying them again with a different method that I saw on TikTok, of course. And those are the ones that I got. I feel like it's so much darker now. What's up, buddy? Oh, whoa. Now it's really pouring. This is my old room, by the way, when I was a teenager. I think I think I had this room from like middle school up until 18 right that used to be my room too you guys will see these rooms in part three my parents whole house um, to clutter and clean up so my main reason for sitting down and I should have filmed this a while ago this happened three weeks ago now yeah it's been three weeks we're moving so I posted a story on Instagram like three weeks ago with just simply saying we're moving and we are so I wanted to come on YouTube and let you guys know for now I'm just doing my mom's house once I'm done with the five-part series at my mom's house then we'll move straight into like an empty house clean with me and do that all again we're excited um, the kids want all their own rooms this time so that's gonna be different but fun um, so I was like, no, I want my own room, Amir wants his own room, and the kids are growing up. We're going to be in a completely different city, for obvious reasons. I will take you guys along as usual, as we always do. Well, that's all I have to say about that for now. I'm also going to end the video here. I'm getting ready to film a cooking video. So, I want to get these nails. I just dropped all of them. It comes with so many. Then you just have to choose which one. These are really short. Wow. Okay, I like my nose short, so that's fine. Yeah, that's it for this video. I just wanted to come on and let you guys know, but I will talk to you in the next one.